Hey everyone, welcome to my first official YouTube video. I want to thank everybody for your support uh, that got me to start this channel. I don't know what I'm going to do uh, yet with this channel, but I do know the most common question I've gotten over all platforms is what is it like to own a Borzoi or one of these magical creatures? Um, I think first off, the most important thing is they're actually a lot easier than it would seem. They are a large breed, but they're very mellow, they're very calm. Esper actually never barks. She's really just like a completely chill, long-legged monster. Uh, they don't have fur, they have hair. So this tends to be hypoallergenic. They do okay in um, smaller spaces, but they definitely need a lot of exercise. I take Esper on runs. We, I'm sure you've seen her spin videos. We go to dog parks. Uh, that's probably the biggest thing I would tell anybody considering getting a Borzo is it's a high level of exercise. Not necessarily that they have a lot of energy and that they jump all over the place. It's just the, for their health, it's good to, for them to get out and, and stretch their legs. Uh, Borzois were bred originally to hunt wolves in packs. They are burst animals. They run very fast for very short distances and then they get very lazy as you can see by this pile of mush that I have in my arms right here. Um, they're very friendly. They're also very aloof, meaning a lot of other dog websites say that Borzois are not intelligent. It's more that they just don't want to do what they don't want to do. They're very independent dogs. So Esper won't do anything she doesn't want to do. And the key to that is to motivate them with love. So they want to do things for you. Um, that said, training does work. They do learn tricks. They know how to stay and come over and, oh, you know your name too. Um, but it just takes a little bit more patience, especially with a breed like this. You have to make sure that you always treat them with kindness because they have, if I would say, if any other dog I've, I've owned, they have a better memory and a higher emotional IQ uh, than most dogs. Um, so I just want to thank you guys. If there's any other questions you have about the breed, I'm going to try to do some Q and A's. I don't really know how to do that yet, so I'm going to figure it out. Um, but thank you guys so much. Let me know what you think.